Welcome to the Portland Music Stream. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you're ready for another great show. Haley Sales has already had quite a career with album releases on Universal and Warner Music, hit songs in Japan and Canada, and acting gigs including Deadpool 2 and Cedar Cove. And it all started for her here in Portland. Haley attended Northwest Academy and appeared in plays at Concordia University and many others before moving north with her family and then on to L.A. for the big time. We're so excited to be partnering with her and hope to bring a little hometown love to tonight's performance. So join the chat, say hi to friends, and let's enjoy from her family's blueberry farm on Vancouver Island, Haley Sales.
I'm sure a lot of you know because I've literally email blasted <laughs> all of you. Uh, Portland's where I grew up. My older brother and his family are still there. I oh, I miss it. I wish I was there. I, I went to middle school at Da Vinci Arts Middle School just around the corner and then um, Northwest Academy downtown. But actually, the funniest part is at Concordia University, when I was 12, I lied about my age. <laughs> And I went to audition for their production of Romeo and Juliet. And uh, thinking I'd get like chorus number seven billion. And I got the role of Juliet and it was so amazing. So I have nothing but good, good memories and vibes. <laughs> oh, I miss you all so much. Um, but back to business. <laughs> I, uh, I want to thank the Alberta Rose for having me. I can't wait to get down there in person and, and do this with you all in the room. And thank you, 
World Sound for helping pull this all together. It's really, really been a saving grace to have these virtual shows. And so I'm sure you're wondering, like, oh, okay, Portland's where you grew up. Where are you? I am currently sitting at my childhood piano that we got on Taylor's Ferry Road um, in southwest Portland that's been in my bedroom since I was about four on my parents' blueberry farm on Vancouver Island up in Canada, eh? Great White North. Um, headed up here from LA when things got a little crazy and it's been, it's been amazing. I've just been recording Christmas songs <laughs> and trying to stay sane as I'm sure we all are. But uh, I'll stop talking on that note, but I, I love you guys and I really hope you're hanging in there. It's going to be, we're going we're gonna to get through all of this and it's, it's going to be worth it in the end. I, I, do, I do believe that. Um, I'm going to play you a bunch of new songs that are going to be on the record that will someday come out when everything, when the timing is right. Uh, but actually also play some of the songs that I wrote when I was a little teenager in Portland for fun. Um, yeah, on that note, kick back. Hope you're enjoying yourself and uh, hopefully you don't hear all the I hear like trucks and everybody pulling up. They're, they're closing down the blueberries for the season. But if you do, you'll know what it is. Um, yeah. Oh, we're going to release this one. This is a new song that's um, coming out, I think, mid-October. All shook up. It's, it's one of my favorites to sing. I, I wrote it driving to uh, drop off my then-boyfriend at Disneyland, which any of you who've driven in L.A., that took five hours. <laughs> in the privacy of my car. <laughs> I'm all 
gone I still could walk away And hear the blinking lights But I'm just too full of curiosity To pass it by night I like to take a pen I'm gonna trust a place to hide I'll sketch in fancy curtains And in an open bottle of wine make set lists and then I always <clears throat> change my mind. Maybe that's, uh, maybe I do that in life too. Um, if you guys are still having fun over there, I think I'm going to play you, yeah, I'll play you this one. Um, this song I actually wrote, it was one of the first songs I wrote um, when I was like 14, 15, and uh, we lived in a really cool old house on Taylor's Ferry, uh, but like, we didn't, you know, we didn't have that much money. And I remember my mom would like tack up sheets for curtains or towels. And in my room, there was this window that I had to use like this metal bobby pin to keep shut. Otherwise it just flew open in the rain and wind. And uh, I started writing this song about that experience and then it grew to be more about falling in love with someone and falling in love and letting love be what's making your decisions over the other things. But um, it's a fun one to sing.
sing right now. I'm missing so many people. Um, but this won't last forever. Um, okay, I've got a couple more songs for you. And then actually, I got a request. And since it's my hometown, and I got to do so many Judy Garland shows at uh, Northwest Children's Theater, I think that I, I think now is the time. Well, not now, after a couple more songs. Um, how are you guys doing? Okay, yay. I feel my hair just like slowly growing into Medusa as I play here. Um, yeah, I'll do that one next. I actually, without disclosing anybody too, too much, wrote this song. It was really close to Northwest Academy, so like right downtown near the library. So just imagine Autumn walking through there and a little teenage Haley, <laughs> always madly romantically in love. <laughs>
up in the night It ain't right, no, it ain't right I toss and turn, toss all and sweat Since we met, oh, since we met Tell me, what have you done? Just a little more Cause I like it Oh, I like it Like never before mm. When they flip off the switch For the night Everything gets perfectly right And when you lean in to whisper goodnight I know it's gonna be so right And I like it Like never before Oh, I want more Just Because the love I see could keep me going every breath I breathe. I don't believe. I don't believe, no. I don't believe love can be shut down. Love can be shut down. Thank you.
reminding myself about that this year. <laughs> the good ones always win. <laughs> person but uh thank you guys so much for watching 
But now for the, uh, <clears throat> encore. Uh, I, I fell madly in love with G. Garland when I was about four. And, uh, kind of set the course of my life in a direction. So, uh, and I did a lot, a lot of annoying people by singing Judy Garland, like in public transit, on the stage, in school bus. And one of my friends was like, you better sing Judy today. So here we are, and uh, I'll sign out after this. But thank you so much for having me again, Alberta Rose Theater. I really, I'm really grateful. If you donate, they're gonna get half of it, or they, they could get all of it. I'm, I'm really, I really wanna keep supporting live theater because we all need it, and it's, this is just a temporary pause, so do what you can. And you're doing what you can by watching this, but um, yeah, thank you for watching. Um, what song am I gonna sing? Oh, I'll do this one. <clears throat> Dear, when you smiled at me, I heard a melody. It haunted me from the start. Something inside of me started a symphony. Zing went the strings of my heart. T'was like a breath of spring. I heard a robin sing about a nest set up high. All nature seemed to be in perfect harmony. Sing went the strings of my heart. Your eyes made sky seem blue again. What else could I do again but keep repeating through and through? I love you. Love you. I still recall the thrill I guess I always will. I hope it will never depart. Dear, with your lips to mine, a oh, rhapsody divine. Zing went the strings of my heart. Meanwhile, I get a, <clears throat> a little dust ball in my throat. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys. I love you. Have a good night, and I'll see you next time. Bye, Portland!